Hey, what's up, guys? I am going to do this video today on um, <clears throat> how to send an attachment from your iPhone. Uh, now, this is something that's <clears throat> particularly important to me because of my job. And when I first got my iPhone and figured out that you couldn't do that, I was pretty uh, distraught. So, obviously, jailbreaking op opens up a lot, of op a lot of opportunities for you to do a lot of different things that Apple does not allow you to do. So uh, I have been searching high and low, and uh, maybe I'm just missing uh, a video that's already out there, but I've not seen one that shows how to send an attachment. So let's get started. First of all, to, you have to know that to do this, you have to have a jailbroken broken phone, obviously, and you have to also have a an, uh, something downloaded called iFile. And so if you don't know what iFile is, Google it, uh, YouTube it. Uh, and you can learn how to download that or how to get that on your phone. Once you have iFile and you have received, it allows you to, once you receive an email, you can save that attachment to your phone. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go into iFile and you're going to send the attachment from iFile. And so iFile looks like this right here. So open up iFile. Then you're going to find the document that you want to send. Mine is just listed under attachments because then I know that it's been their attachments from uh, you know things that I've received. So I'm going to go in here to invoices, and I'm going to open up an invoice here. And let's say that I want to send this invoice right here. The way that you do that is you hit edit, click on the attachment that you want to send, <clears throat> and then it'll give you an option at the bottom. It looks like a little mail. You want to hit that and then it opens up as if you're in your email. Go ahead and type in here where you want to send it to and for some odd reason, I haven't figured this out yet, so maybe I'll post a um, you know another letter after, after I figure or another uh, YouTube video after I figure this out, but it doesn't allow you to actually access your contact book, so maybe I'm just doing something wrong here. But if you start typing something in, normally it would come up with your different contacts. In this case it does not. So you have to just kind of do it from memory, I guess. Um, which is kind of stupid, but type in your email address, hit send, and it will send with it the attachment here, which in this case you can see it's a PDF file. It's a PDF file. So um, I just stumbled upon it today, uh, and the crazy thing about it is you wouldn't realize that you could do it even if you had iFile, because if you don't hit edit, that little mail symbol is not down at the bottom. Only after you hit edit and you click on the document does it appear and give you that option then to send. So um, anyways, hope that this is helpful to someone. This was very helpful to me when I figured it out for myself. And like I said, if I figure out that it's um, there's another way to kind of access your contacts, I'll definitely post another video. Okay, guys, hope that helps. Have a great one.